Hey y'all, welcome to another vlog. It is a Sunday morning. I had to think about the day. It's Sunday morning. Lodane and I are just getting up. We stayed the night in Dallas last night. Ah. <laughs> and Lodane did not sleep well, which is partially my fault because we fell asleep with the TV on and then she woke up in the night thinking that I needed the TV for noise. I just didn't care enough to turn it off and poor thing barely slept. And she is very tired and has a headache, but hopefully she's gonna feel better soon because we're about to go get some iced coffee. We gotta pack up here. We gotta leave in about 20 minutes out of the room. And we're stopping at McDonald's to get some big ol' iced coffees. Or she's getting hot coffee, I'm getting iced coffee. And then we are headed to Little Rock to see another show tonight. And uh, what's going on doing back here? <laughs> Yeah, shot of hot water and soap did wonders, boss. <laughs> so after trying to find our way in Dallas to a McDonald's, we finally made it. Um, Google Maps sucks ass. We're about to get a new map app. Yeah, I'm. I can't. Yeah. Yeah, we finally made it to a drive-through line though, and we're waiting to get our iced coffee. And then we're hitting the road back to Arkansas. We got about four and a half hours to drive. And y'all, at this McDonald's in uh, Dallas, they have. Um, at this McDonald's in Dallas, they have the sugar-free vanilla syrup. So I'm getting a sugar-free vanilla iced coffee. And what is this clusterfuck going on in front of me here? Yeah, I gotta try to squeeze my way into here. Iced coffee has been obtained. The sugar-free vanilla is really good. I, I guess it's just regional because they don't have it in Hot Springs. But they had it in Colorado and they have it in Dallas. So yeah, it's really good. Did you try yours yet? Mm. It's gonna be hot as hell. Mm. Yeah. Lodane's still not feeling 100% yet. Mm. <laughs> she feels very meh. But I hope the coffee's gonna perk her up. I gotta get gas here and then uh, we're hitting the road. Y'all, I'm getting gas at the Chevron that also had the McDonald's attached to it. Gas is still pretty cheap here in Texas, only $2.85 a gallon for regular. And while I'm fueling up, here's a little view of where we are. I think we're in a pretty like hipster area of Dallas down here. And here's the little food mart McDonald's that we just got our coffee at. And that place was hopping, man. It took us forever to get through that drive through and yeah, once I fill up, we're, hit, we're hitting the interstate and we should be in Arkansas, um, or we should be at our hotel somewhere around 4, 4.30 p.m. made a little pit stop at Duke's off the highway. They've got a taco casa, <laughs> a Colton Belt barbecue, a whole bunch of gas pumps, um, but we're just going into pee and I might get a water or something. How you doing, Lodane? Feeling better over there? Yeah, headache's gone. Good. The uh, desire to kill the majority of Dallas is waning. Oh my God, yeah. Jesus. Look how pretty the sky looks up there above Dukes, man. It's a beautiful day for a drive. Now that we're out of Dallas. They have all this handmade wooden furniture in here that you can buy. It's pretty cool. Here's some over here, like these chairs. Those are neat. You can get your Dukes merch in here. All right. This is a huge store. Like they have a ton of stuff in here. Lots of souvenirs and just like random stuff everywhere. They even sell drug rugs here. I like the red one. Oh, I like the purple one. I would never wear one of those, but. I mean, you know. <laughs> Going to take a pee. Wow, look at this. Are you laughing at me? Filming my going to take a pee? Mm -hmm. I need content, man. Road trips, not much going on but driving. Cool pictures on the wall though. 
little bathroom wall graffiti. Now we're getting drinks and they have a large selection of drinks here. I'm just getting a spring water for now. They didn't have any sugar-free coffee drinks or I would have got one of those. What are you going for, Lodane? Uh, <laughs> There's too much to choose from. No, nothing sounds good. Yeah. Cool. You want a water? Ugh. Ugh. I hate water. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Spring water too, finally. The last few gas stations I've gone to have not had spring water. Now they have to know the exciting conclusion of what drink you chose. Well, I'm, maybe I'm not done. Maybe I'm gonna get a hair of the dog. Get me a, are, are yeah. give me a shot of whiskey. <laughs> I don't think they do that here, but you know. Maybe. They do have some wine over there. Yeah. I know. Ugh. Wine would be the... Oh, it'd be the worst. I don't want the spins while we're on a road trip. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, well, I got she went with water. life water. I like life, life water. 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 are going off already i know are yeah. we in a dangerous part of town i don't no, think so I think it's, well tacos and beer right over there all know. right well we're well, it we're can't at the be all bad <laughs> truck wash with a bunch of graffiti i think we're in a good area oh yeah it's great it's not bad it's not bad over no, here behind the hotel nice there's like some kind of catholic school over here and like houses my hand's shaking y'all hold on had to readjust my grip so we're staying in the holiday inn there's Lodane, and we're going into to, to check in our room. Actually, Ted's already checked in our room, and the dogs are here. We could charge our electric cars here. Yeah. We could, yeah. So we're going to get set up in the room, and then we've got to get some food and head over to the bar. Do you want breakfast or like drinks or uh, mm -hmm. the points? I told her to give me the, the points. points. Hell yeah. All right, we're on the fifth floor. How many floors does this thing have? Eight floors. Oh, wow. All Look right. The ice machine right there. Awesome. And then we're right by the stairs if it catches on fire. Okay, cool. We can run down in a hurry. We can run down much easier than run up. <laughs> yeah, right yeah. All right, let's see the room. There they are. Hey, pumpkins. Hey, pumpkins, have you been good? Come on. Out. They'll come back. Yeah, come on, baby. So here's our room. We got two beds. This is nice. Yeah, ain't bad. It is pretty nice. <laughs> I know, babies. So my dogs are real happy to see me, but Ted said they've been behaving pretty well, except for when he first checked into the hotel. Yeah, she was barking a lot. Morty was just like yelping. Oh yeah, he doesn't bark. He but just makes a little whines. Trying to, like check in and they were just going, going crazy. Around. Yeah, because they they love. There's people around. They love it. So we gotta feed them before we go. Aww, dogs are happy to see Lodate again yeah. too. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get freshened up and go eat. We are going to Camp David Kitchen to get some food. This is against my will. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're out here. We're eating outside the hotel and we got ourselves a couple of drinks to start it off with. Yeah, it tastes kind of weak here at Camp David. It does? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was making it strong in the room. Right? Oh, yeah. Ted well, started you without can't us. Taste it anymore, Ted. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you might have a problem. I got that joke from Cheers. <laughs> Still a good joke. And then here's the menu. We're going to get some food. I don't know what oh, I'm going to get. Yeah. I might get a sandwich. Uh, I don't know. Here's our view from our dining table, y'all. We get to see road construction on the interstate and the other Holiday Inn that's right across the street from this one. We're in the, we are in the presidential suites. This one was $6 more a night than that. Yeah, and we chose this one because it had a restaurant in it so we could get food here. So some of our food is, has arrived. Ted got catfish with french fries and mixed vegetables. That is a shitload of food. Puppies, yeah. Oh, and Nobody hush puppies. And this stuff is cheap. It's like $12. Yeah, it's a good deal. And then Lodane got a burger and Ooh, pub so chips. Yeah. And I got a flatbread I'm waiting on her to bring out. Yeah, I got grilled onions on this burger. 
Yeah. As always. <laughs> Y'all, my food is here and holy shit, I ordered a barbecue chicken flatbread Damn. and she said I could get fries with it. I do not think I'm going to be able to eat all this food. We're going to have to put some of this in the refrigerator for later. Or you guys have a piece if you want of the flatbread. Try it out. Yeah, I'll try it. And then, oh my God, y'all, everybody here at the hotel is so nice. The waitress is super cool. She brought us a whole carafe of water and uh, she's, she's awesome. She's like, yeah, you guys can go out there, drink, smoke, and chill on the patio. Yeah. All right, I'm about to eat this. I mean, they're good movies. I liked it. I just could never understand what, like, how people, it's just a movie. How do you get that much into this? Probably a healthy reaction. Chad and Lodane are discussing Star Wars movies, and I'm eating my chicken flatbread. This shit is really good. All right, so did you ever watch Star Trek? A little bit. My dad used to like it. Okay, guys, we are ready. The gang is here. <laughs> And we are heading downstairs because this hotel actually has a shuttle that's going to take us. Are these the elevators? Yeah, this is it. Oh. Um, has a shuttle that's going to take us to the bar for free. So where we're going to go see the concert, which I haven't even told you guys what it is yet. We are going to see Melissa Carper, an Arkansas native who plays bluegrass music. Yay! We're in the shuttle. Yeah, we're ready to roll. You ready to roll, Odell? Mm-hmm. All right. Already. Yeah, I'm already rolling. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Yeah. It's called a hotel, I guess. All right. All right, awesome. All right, y'all, we've arrived at Whitewater Tavern on the Holiday Inn Express Shuttle. And we're about to go in and check it out. Yeah. I'm trying to show the sign, but like there's a big pole in front. There we go, Whitewater Tavern. Very, very evil. We missed most of the show, unfortunately. Uh, <laughs> but we're gonna have one more drink and head back to the hotel. So the bar has cleared out after the show and we're just walking around at last call, hanging out. This place is really cool. It's a super old building, the Whitewater Tavern. See the beams on the ceiling and all these bands that have come here. It's a really cool place in Little Rock if you ever get a chance to come here. Could recommend it. Very intimate place. I love the vibe here. Uh, the only bands I recognize that have come here are the fucking Pogues and uh, Shovels and Rope. But yeah, we're having a good old time talking to the bartender about the local punk scene. Real cool place. I'm glad we came, even though we didn't see much of the show. Almost nine and they're packing it up. Oh yeah, it's bar. nine o'clock and they're Bar's closing down. Closing. Sunday, yep. Sunday, yeah. We're waiting outside the bar for our shuttle, our hotel shuttle to come pick us up. There's Ted. There's Lodane looking gorgeous over there in her pink. <laughs> in the street light. Oh yeah. My high visibility construction gear. I love it. I love it. So it's like 9 30 and we're just trying to get back to the hotel and go hit up the hotel bar. 
Oh, we're not going to make it if it's closes at 10. Oh, we might find another. <laughs> <laughs> we're still waiting on our shuttle. Oh, and yeah. this black cat has come up to love on me. Hey, precious. We're sitting on the steps of the bar. Oh, precious kitty. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, you gotta, let's get some goat shirt. We made it back to the hotel. Finally, our shuttle came. We stood outside the bar for about 30 minutes. We made it back to the hotel right at bar closing time, but the bartender is so cool here. She's gonna let us have one drink before they close up. Oh, it's 12 after yeah. 10? But she's got people in there, so she's like, well, I'll make some more money. Yeah, she's gonna give us one more drink. We might wanna go in there and get the drinks instead of make her bring them out. I'm not oh, sure. that's true. We that. Yeah, we yeah. could do that. I'm gonna tip her real well, too, because she didn't have to do this. She went above and beyond yeah. for us. Hey, y'all, well, yeah. it's the next day. It is Monday morning. Lodane and I are packed up in the car and headed back to Oklahoma City. Ted left and went back, took the dogs back to Hot Springs. Good riddance. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm <laughs> and we had a great time last night. The show was like so short and they closed the bar at like nine o'clock. It was crazy. Um, but we ended up going back to the hotel and we had the coolest freaking bartender who like basically stayed open for two hours past closing just for us. She was awesome. And uh, yeah, we just hung out at the hotel all night, went to bed, woke up about 45 minutes before we had to check out of the hotel room and made it out. And now we're, yeah, like I said, we're headed back to Oklahoma City. I'm taking Lodane home. I'm going to stay the night at her house tonight. Oh, you're forgetting the, the best part. What? Ted and Cindy, we saw this cement truck and it was actually currently mixing and they dared me to go and like chug <laughs> as much of it as I could. And it <laughs> fucked up my throat, but man... <laughs> I, I'm still full, like, oof. Full of pure cement. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we are here at this little Exxon in Conway, Arkansas right now, outside of Little Rock. Gotta get some gas, get fueled up, get some water. And so I guess I want to wrap up this vlog. Thank you guys so much for joining us. And uh, we're, gonna, we're just going to be traveling today for about four and a half more hours. And then we're going to go see my sister, Marge. <laughs> and, her, and her husband, he's an idiot. He likes donuts a lot. <laughs> Bye, guys. Man.